Yeah, we're trying to do a lot of things, reaching out not as much or obviously to members, but also beyond the membership right now. So we're doing um, things that especially younger generation is very familiar with. LinkedIn, Facebook, um, we revived the blog, we're starting to do Flickr and YouTube to spread the word. And also, oh, I think it's very important to keep informal communication amongst the members beyond the conference, because we were talking about it the, recently that you measure this conference in number of hugs, because it's so friendly, but then you leave and you talk to a few people, but you never get engaged into continuous like, sharing of ideas and just bouncing. Um, news, so I had a baby, uh, what's happening to school, we have a budget cut, how do you resolve that? So I really want to focus to keep this communication, first of all, both ways amongst the members, not only when you have e-news, which is from iDeck and it's news, but it doesn't promote communication as much, and also reach out to general public and educate what interior design is about, what interior design education is about, and recruit new members. Show them how friendly we are, that we are making a difference, and they need to join us. One of the members at the first day of the conference asked me if we could have an iPhone application. So I think we'll probably take over the most popular communication venues or social media venues. Hopefully, involve more students as well. And I think we'll, we'll embrace as much technology as we can and really keep communication amongst members and non-members going that it becomes part of their life. When I say Facebook, iDeck is one of those uh, places where you leave a comment.